Everybody's talking about self-care these days. When your job involves looking after others, it's hard to think much about looking after yourself. It just feels wrong somehow. But as they say, you're not much good to others if you're not okay yourself. How do you talk to people about looking after themselves? You probably talk about good nutrition, the importance of a good night's sleep, the problems with alcohol and other substances, the importance of physical activity and relaxation, and maybe you even teach them some mindfulness skills. That's all good advice. But advice is easy to ignore. Doing an exercise around self-care may help the message stick. What springs to mind for you personally when you think about self-care? Whatever it is, it's different for everyone. I wonder if you've done much of it lately. Something you might find some benefit in is creating a self-care plan. You might also like to learn to help someone make their own self-care plan. To create a plan, you need to ask some questions. What have you enjoyed doing or having in your life in the past when things were going well? What self-care strategies seem to work for the people around you? What things do you think you would like to try? Think about things that might benefit your mind, your body and your spirit. Maybe you're neglecting one particular aspect of your well-being. Perhaps that's the area that it would be worth focusing on. When you've answered those questions, you'll have a nice long list of possibilities. Take a closer look at the list. Cross off the strategies that you know won't work for you or are not possible at the moment. From what remains, choose the strategy that looks the most possible, the most appealing, or that you feel you need the most. Then make a plan to try it out for a couple of weeks. After two weeks, decide whether it's been a good thing or not. If it has, put it on your list of go-to self-care strategies and work out how to fit it into your daily routine on a permanent basis. You'll need more than one thing on that list in case something comes up that interferes with your doing it. After a little while, you'll have a short list of self-care strategies that you can activate any time you need them in any circumstance. Developing a self-care plan takes a little time and effort, but it's worth doing. These strategies are an important part of that plan. Stress tends to make all of us forget how to look after ourselves just when we need it most, and self-care is a necessity for everyone.